and just get out. She knows what she wants. I know what I want from this sketch. So I'm I know this seems to be a recurring theme, but I did want to look better in this week's video. But this is the result of 32 degree heat in London. Humidity, sweating, rank. Let's get started! So, Tandem Bank is a new type of bank that is basically made up of a community of regular people who think they can run a bank better than old-fashioned bankers. And these people are called co-founders. And these people are just regular people, like designers, entrepreneurs, techies. And they get to decide on everything from the type of products to the name, etc. Cool, huh? Now Tandem Bank have got in contact with me and have basically challenged me to really think about what I call home home and kind of about my own housing situation. I can only assume that they watched my recent Channel 4 show about being 30 and thought that I was mature and responsible enough to be working with a bank. I mean this could go very wrong. I have rented all my life and I have honestly never thought about buying a house. But I just prefer to spend my money on smoothies, holidays and Uber. Oh dear. Anyway, people keep telling me that because I've been renting for so long I'm basically just throwing money down the drain. And I'm kind of starting to think that they've got a point. One. As I said, apparently you're just I. I just. I'm basically throwing money down the drain with basically nothing to show for it. Um, hey. I'm your landlord. Oh, hi, how's it going? Very well. Good, how can I help? Um, I just wondered if you'd like to pay me loads of money each month, have things break and me probably never fix them. Oh, yeah, I'd love that. Yeah, awesome, cool, yeah. How much is that? Uh, just a thousand pounds a month. Oh, God, that's that's fine. Yeah, I'll just transfer you. Oh, wonderful, yeah? great. So I'll transfer you, yeah. Yeah. And um, also, um, yeah. don't ever email me because I probably won't ever reply. Oh, Bye. that's cool. All right, thank you very much. Bye. What a lovely man. Mm. Two. It sucks to rent because when you have friends over, you're basically never going to want to serve them red wine in case you stain the carpets and lose your deposit. Fun party! Oh my god, I know this is a this is a so fun, isn't it? I know how to throw a party. Woo -hoo! Mm. Woo! Yeah, we need some alcohol. Is this way guys. It's not. Three. Even if you hate your flat and flatmates and want to move out, you can't. Because it's too expensive to save up for the deposit you need to move anywhere else. So you're stuck with them. What do you want to watch? Mm, porn. No. <sighs> are, you, are you kidding me? When you're forced to live with others, there are so many house-sharing politics that are just mind-numbingly boring. Okay then, you pay the water and I'll pay the rent, the gas, the electric and the internet, because that seems completely fair. Okay, cool. Look, you cook all the time. You, you have to pay more gas than me. I don't like this loo roll. It hurts my bum. It gives me a rash. Can you just, just buy some, uh, some softer ones? Five! This one my friend actually told me. She said she had a really pervy landlord at a place that she used to live at and he would regularly ring her and ask her out for a drink. Now this is all good if your landlord is really sexy, but let's be honest, he probably isn't. Six. Now when we moved into this flat, we asked for it to be furnished because, let's be honest, I couldn't be bothered to buy loads of stuff for a place that I'm just renting in. But I realised my mistake in doing this was that I then had no choice in the furniture they provided and the chances were fairly high that they were going to choose rank furniture. And when I say rank I mean cheap. So what happened? Well I moved in, didn't like any of the stuff they provided so I then paid to get that stuff put into storage and then bought my own stuff anyway. Bed, curtains, chest of drawers, bedside table. Who's laughing now, property owners? <laughs> Not me. My bank are definitely laughing at me. Seven. This will happen every year. Oh, hello. Hi, Hello. Mm -hmm. um, 
I just wanted to let you know that um, your, your rent's going up from next year. I'm just gonna whack on a smidge, just 500. That's okay? Wonderful. Bye. Eight. The strong possibility of getting served notice after being a very relaxed and respectful and perfect tenant, just whenever the landlord chooses, really. Yes? Um, get out. Well, I haven't done anything. I've paid my rent on time. I've been a really good tenant. I, why? No reason. Just get out. Nine. Random visits from your landlord at inappropriate times? Yeah, Nick, in a long time in my flat. On my own. Nick, I'm Hello, my, Oh my god, what are you doing here? And ten. And finally, the last reason why renting sucks, in my humble opinion, is because when you rent, people are going to constantly say this to you. Look, you should definitely get on the property ladder. Yeah, I, I, could, I could think about buying somewhere, I guess. When's a good time to buy? Now. Now? No, 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 wait, 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 wait. Maybe leave it a year. Oh, okay, well, yeah, I'll, I'll listen to you because I, I have no idea, so I'll just, just wait a year, yeah? Well, now, now Brexit might be affecting it. Oh, right, yeah, that's a good point. So, so now, not in a year then? Oh, uh, you, you missed it. What? <sighs> right. Well, there you go. 10 reasons why renting sucks. Massive thank you to Andy for helping me out. He was a real gem. Also, massive thanks for Tandon Bank for wanting to work with me. I mean, that it was honestly really flattering. Now, I'm also gonna be doing some interviews on behalf of Tandon Bank, where I'll be meeting various people and communities who have a different take on housing. I'll leave all the links down below, and all you need to do is sign up to be a co-founder, and then you'll be able to watch these wonderful interviews, because they will be wonderful. And if you don't want to watch these interviews, well, uh, I, I don't like you. I also need to stick my head while my whole body into a fridge, because I am so sweaty! Thanks for watching. So long and farewell. Is it farewell? Oh. I literally am not doing this well. Ah! Three, one, one more time. One more time! <laughs> By the way, you, you spat all around. <laughs> Gross! <laughs> I'm not doing that one again. <laughs> that was gross, guys. I had a boob tube on. Let's on tour. Let's on tour, let's on tour.